Good morning. I've got some very strange shadows going on here and I can't work out why. <laughs> Don't know what this is. <sighs> anyway, uh, yeah, sun keeps in and out, so apologies. Anywho, um, I'm making these little journals uh, totally inspired by a piece of junk mail. Well, it's not junk mail, actually. It was a new um, SIM card that I got for the phone. Um, yeah, and it looked like this. And I thought, oh, now then. I think that would make a really nice little journal, which it does. So um, I've made them Midori style with, uh, you know, refillable. And I'll show you inside. So there's a little journal. And so you can replace the papers. <clears throat> and then you've got a policy envelope is it called one of those things anyway and in there I've just put some um, fabric snippet bits and a little notepad thing put in what you like really so you know they're not massive they're only um, where's my ruler gone yeah I think they're about six inches six and a half inches tall and then about four and a half inches wide so um yeah i think they're quite nice i think quite handy little sizes actually and as i say i've done a midori style so you can refill the papers to your heart's content um and yeah it's just all from that little thing there sorry let me just get that tied up again and we'll make one together i'm sorry about the uh, husky voice i've got flu which is just marvelous I just haven't stopped temperature wise up and down, so never mind. Not going to stop creating. <laughs> so, yeah, um, because of the flaps, um, this will fit on a piece of A4 paper, that shape there. Um, well, I've got these weird shadows. Uh, but when you put the flaps on, it won't. So, what I've done is I've got a massive uh, book, which is here. Hang on this great big thing it is enormous um and what i did was i just made some collage boards out of a whole sheet and then that template fits on there so um yeah it's probably going to be sort of more like an a3 piece and then you've got the extra bits you can cut up into tags and things so but as you can see that's it there all right and then i just angled in the cuts here just to make it look more you know like we like it so that's that really exciting wasn't it so i have a uh, gel mat medium to the outside i've done I've got a couple more and i've got one more behind me this one i had an a6 uh sorry uh a six by six paper pad i've never I, I just don't use six by six and i thought right well i need to start doing something with it so I just ripped it all into pieces and collaged the heck out of it onto one of those big pages. And it's turned out lovely. And it really has. So um, I did a little bit of uh, stenciling on top. But yeah, so they're a bit curly because I only put the gel matte medium on yesterday. But um, yeah, good. I like them. I like them a lot. So anyway, let's get on. Um, I've done a topper, which is here which will go here. So this is quite vintage, this one. The other one has got, this is the bits and bobs for the other one. Um, just quickly show you, we might not get to this one. I'll just do the vintagey one. And that goes there, because when you put your topper on, you need to remember that your flap's gonna come over. So you don't want it to fill. Well, you can have it filling the whole thing if you want, but. Um, I thought it looked better like that. So, and then I've just got um, one of these sort of fabricy paper paper swatchy things. I think we did them with um, Rachel. And then these were just little scrap paper pads, basically. And that'll go in there. Okay. And we'll do the doodads. You know what I mean. You know, doodads. And then the papers and that are. <coughs> excuse me um yeah just loads of papers and things right stop yabbering let's get on so let's get it around the right way uh first of all i think we'll get our um 
thingies on. Oh dear, sorry about the sniffing. It's going to happen and I'm sorry, but yeah. I really could have done without a cold this morning, but yeah. Um, let's get some eyelets. Yes, I thought it was the dreaded you-know-what, but it's not. Oh, you're not the same colour, or are you? No. Sorry, the lighting is so weird. <coughs> I've tried shutting the blind and then it's too dark. No. And these are just brown cardboard. So right. let's punch a hill. That's my big one there. In the middle ish. That's about right. So I hope everybody's well. Um yeah, obviously I'm dying, but you know. Um yeah, it's a glorious day, but <coughs> got lots to do need to keep going can't stop crafting i just spent on more or less the whole day asleep yesterday it was shocking but i just didn't have any get up and go so i turned into a senior citizen yesterday <laughs> i just fell asleep I only woke up because the cat was pouring at me. She's like, stop starving. Come on, feed me. Right. And we all know that's not true. Right. Uh, let's have a nice... I'll put some wax thread on there. Then that'll look nice. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Go under and just behave yourself now. Go on. I should have left a little bit of room there. But didn't. <clears throat> Come on. <coughs> Once you get them broken in, they behave themselves, these things. I don't like to do too many windy things. Come on. Actually, that'd probably be enough, just one. <clears throat> Otherwise it gets a little bit ridiculous if you're sort of constantly doing that, so. Okay. Um, I hope you can hear me. I've had a couple of comments that people are struggling to hear me, but I don't want to end up being shouty, so. Yeah, well, let me know. I know you will. Right, so <clears throat> I've got these ones for in here. Let's do the let's do the Midori bit. Um, these are the little ditty. Uh, I can't remember what size they are. Three sixteenths. I think black will look right on there, won't it? Mm, I think I've got 
We've got beige. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think that's the best colour. <coughs> I do like to put the little washers on the back of these because I um, always worry that they're going to pop out if I don't. Make sure your flaps out of the way. Sorry, turn off screen on the It's close-ish to the top. I did cut the papers slightly smaller so they would fit in. So hopefully I'm getting it about right. Yep. Well done, Susan. Well done. And now the sun's gone in. I hope you can still see all right. Let's turn me crocodile to the sorry, crocodile to the smallest setting. I got my ring on, so hopefully that will be good. Doogie. So one thing I didn't get was uh, any elastic already. Well done. Let's just round that slightly. I've got a bit of rust dyed fabric for the um, tie. Just grab me elastics. did not want to come out of their box but they did sorry bear with me I just need to blow my nose sorry um right, I think I think black would be alright on there actually Surprising how little you need elastic wise. leave them longer if you want and put a charm on it's completely up to you right so let's pop the papers in yeah so there you go see it's totally reusable and refillable and what have you that did that wrong. I 
the chunky little monkeys. Right. So yeah, I've got this nice piece of, I think it's one that Fiona did. Thank you, Fiona. Your fabrics and everything was absolutely to die for. I did do a share, so check through the um, the videos. Her rust iron was just stunning. Absolutely stunning. Very clever lady. Um, I think I want the more decorative on the front. So I tuck it under there. Just get a clip on there. This makes it a lot more easier. Right, okay. Right, so I want it to come just above that piece there. And enough to tie there. Yep, yeah, that should be fine. And then what I'll do is I'll use the the topper to seal it on and there's a lot of pre-prep gone into that you know you make your master board first and then you know you do your whatever bits you want oh, cats in here what do you want trouble Plenty of glue because it's got to hold the fabric as well. I'll put that about there. Give it a good squish. No, oh, don't use blue ink when you know you haven't got your fingers protected. By the way, <laughs> I can't wash it off. Three showers I've had and it's still there. Well done, Tim Holtz. Where have you gone? Because you're just going to jump up at me, aren't you? Oh, she's going up to the bed, that's right. <laughs> Otherwise it's like, she just comes out of nowhere. I'm just going to put that on there for a minute. So yeah, that's it really. It's, um, here comes the sun now, typical. Quite a simple little, little, little mini journals, quite sweet. Uh, you pull, thank you. And you. Let's get some decent scissors. <clears throat> I don't think I'll try and make too many videos today because uh, I'm a bit sniffy, aren't I? It'll drive you bonkers. And we don't want that. Right, so they are quite rotund, these little things. So uh, just need to give them a minute. There. Cute, huh? Yeah, they're great fun making these. I'll get the other one done and. Uh, That'll be that, really. Get him a little shop -o, and I'll be done. Whoa, no, don't fall off. Cute. Yeah, like. So there we are, simple as. So, um, yeah, look for inspiration from your junk mail. I think when that turned up, I thought, ooh. 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 So yeah, it's six and a half tall <coughs> and four and I don't know, I don't know what they are. Um, it's 11.3 11, 11 centimetres, that bit, and then that bit's about the same-ish. And then that's one and a half inches, the flap, I think. Say one and a quarter but you haven't got to put the flap on if you don't want to you haven't even got to do the flaps inside 
So there we are. I thought you'd like to see that, what I've been mucking around with. This one I did slightly differently because um, I don't know why I did it, but I put fabric on the inside and I stitched around it. But that was my prototype. That was the first one I did just to see if the actual design would work. And it did. So, um, And that's another project that has just been sitting around. I'm trying to get projects done. But I've been like, oh, yeah, I must do that. Oh, yeah, I must do that. And I don't know. Oh, here comes trouble. What do you want? Mackerel. I'm videoing, dear. You can't just gate crash a party. Can you even see her? Yeah, she's here. <laughs> yeah, but I'm videoing. Is that it? Have I got to stop now? Oh, God. Right, <laughs> I'm going to stop the camera. Mackerel, please. Oh, my lordy. All right, I'll see you on the next one before there's a catastrophe. Don't pull the wire out. <sighs> Bye. <laughs>